Hey guys, I got this uh, <clears throat> old axe head that I've had sitting around for quite some time now. And so I picked up a new axe handle and now I'm going to go ahead and put a new handle on it. So this is just a little test fit. Oh, that's going to fit nice. Yep. So sometimes you'll have to carve them down. And you definitely don't want to get one too small, but sometimes you'll have to carve them down to, to fit. But this one's gonna, this one's actually gonna be pretty dang, pretty dang close. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is just pound this till it kind of sticks out a little bit. It's gonna sit proud. Oh, you know, a quarter inch or so. And I'll put the wedges in. Okay, you know what I did is I took this thing. I just, you can use any old piece. You can use a big old nail if you need to, but just put that on the end there and, and pound it on the top of that to knock it down. And did the same thing with, with that side right there. It's just an old rusty, some kind of file, but it's hardened steel. So just pounding on that and knocking it in. Okay, that's about right where I want it. Now I'll go ahead and take out my wood wedges, pound them in there. So as you can see, I'm gonna have to trim this up a little bit, right, because it's too wide, so I'll just cut it right there. Okay, so I marked it about where I wanna cut it, so I'm just gonna, it'll snap. I can snap that right off. I just took my hammer and gave it a whack on the edge of my knife there. Okay, what I'm gonna do is put this old carpenter, basically wood glue, down in here before I put that wooden wedge in. that in there. I'm just going to give this a tap. All right, I got that wedge in there as far as it'll go. I'm going to just go ahead and clean it up and then just cut it off. And drill, it, drill a hole through here, and then I'm going to pound a, pound a nail through it. And what I did now is just I found a nail that goes all the way through it. I'm just going to hack that off there, and it's nice and tight. Just to keep it from slipping out. All right, there we go. I put a little shine on it, too, with the grinding wheel. Pin one in, I just nail just ground it off too flush with that other side all right so now I'm just gonna cover this with linseed oil all right there's the finished product I love a nice axe thing for axe axes and chainsaws never have enough just look cool all right thank you for watching